so here we are discussing about a problem on higher order and isoparametric element okay so there is an a triangular element that is cst like this and the nodes are 1 2 3 okay and their coordinates also it is mentioned like at 1 it will be 1 1 it means x1 y1 is 1 x1 is 1 y1 is 1 and at 2 it is 4 and 2 at 3 x3 is 3 and y3 is 5 so these are the coordinates at each node that is x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 respectively and there is a a point p which is located inside the cst okay and their coordinates are x and y for the point p and also mention the shape functions for node 1 the shape function is 0.15 and for node 2 the shape functions is 0.25 so these two are the shape functions and the shape functions for n3 you need to find out as we know that the sum of the shape functions n1 plus n2 plus n3 is equal to 1 okay so in this problem you have to determine what is x okay so what is this x and what is y coordinate for the point p that you have to calculate using these values okay the solution will start now so now the coordinates at p that is x so we'll say x surface p for the point at x okay the formula it will be n1 x1 plus n2 x2 plus n3 x3 okay now here as we can make this n1 n2 n3 is equal to 1 minus n2 or n1 minus n2 okay like that we, we can make this is 1 n1 minus n2 so we here substitute the value of n n value is 0.15 into x value this one as 1 plus n2 value is 0.25 into x2 is 4 plus n3 value n3 value as this one 1 minus n1 n1 is again 0.15 directly you can substitute minus 0.25 n2 into x3 okay into this x3 x3 value is 3 so now we calculate so i got the values 2.95 as x value similarly we'll calculate for 2 also uh, for y also so y suffix p is equal to n1 y1 plus n2 y2 plus n3 y3 okay same method what is the value of n1 0.15 and y1 is this one 1 plus n2 value is 0.25 and y2 is 2 plus n3 is 1 minus n1 n1 is again 0.15 minus n2 is 0.25 into y3 okay what is the value of y3 that is 5 okay into 5 okay now we we'll just calculate so y3 y suffix p is equal to 3.65 we obtain okay so this is the method to calculate the coordinates for x and y for the point p 
ओके सो थैंक यू